The question is, can you please review the sequel to the Food Matters movie? It's called Hungry for Change. I think you have a strong opinion. Me? Opinionated? No way. Good question. I actually did watch this documentary. I watched it from start to finish, just so I can give an objective during a lot of review, because people love my hear my opinions on the tube. So here's my opinion of Hungry for Change. I thought it was a crock of shit. I mean, really. You got Mike Adams rattling on it. And I got nothing personal against Mike Adams or Daniel Vitalis or Dave Wolf or anyone producers. Nothing personal. This is my comments and criticisms. So we got Mike Adams talking about refined sugar, sugar's bad, sugar's bad. I went to Mike Adams' website, Natural News TV or MikeAdams.com, whatever it is. I looked on there and I'm like, Mike Adams sells refined sugar. It's called coconut nectar or coconut sugar. <laughs> he sells sugar in a bottle and he's making fun of sugar in a bottle. It's like, what? Refined sugar is refined sugar, man. Yeah, one might be certified organic, but it doesn't matter. It's refined sugar. So if you're going to be dissing refined sugar and you're selling refined sugar, in my eyes, you're going to look like a fucking hypocrite. And now nothing person is Mike Adams. I think he's got some great things to say. Just the ramblings he said on this Hungry for Change documentary. I was like, oh, how confusing that's going to be for the, for the newbies out there. But that's, I guess, a lot of these documentaries are for is a bit of a marketing infomercial Thing, in my opinion, because what's the message, what's the take-home message I have? Don't eat carbohydrates, fruit's bad for you, rice is bad for you, fill up on my products on my website, superfoods are good as long as you're buying from me, for the, you know, like this nonsense stuff. And then we talk about the weight loss, where the weight loss experts, Daniel Vitalis and David Wolf, nothing personal against DV and DW, are they brothers? I don't know, they look like brothers anyway, nothing personal against these guys, but are they the best people for weight loss? Just say it. And then we had some other people in there who jacked up on caffeine or something, just like, I'm on steroids and I'm just juice fasting and I'm... Uh, and someone's calling a croissant a high carbohydrate food. So I'm sorry, but a croissant is about 50% calories and coming from fat. It's not like a banana where 3% of calories coming from fat. So when someone's eating croissants and they're wondering why they're getting fat, it's because of the fat in the croissant. And often people have cheese with their croissant and bacon ass with their croissant. So they're having almost 80% of calories coming from fat. They eat their croissant and they go, oh, I can't eat bananas because bananas are fattening. Even though this croissant's 80% calories coming from fat, that banana's 3% calories coming from fat. I can't eat bananas so they're carbohydrates, so I'm going to eat croissants. I'm going to eat fat eating carbohydrates, so I better watch Hungry for Change and get some weight loss tips off the overweight guys. That's just my comments and criticisms. Crock of crap. Hungry for Change. I'm hungry for change. I'm hungry for a documentary that actually tells the truth. Oh, actually, there is one. There's forks over knives. There's eating. There's healing cancer from within. There's all these documentaries out there. There's my YouTube channel. Telling the truth versus infomercial, salesy, multi-level marketing nonsense. Buy a 10-pack DVD, blah, 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 special, whatever. How about some truth? How about a video that's subjective? How about a video that exposes the scams and the hucksters in the hell food movement? How about that? I'm hungry for change for that sort of video. That's just my comments and criticisms. Nothing personal against anyone. Thanks for watching. Post your comments down below. What do you think of the Hungry for Change documentary? What is your comments and criticisms? Thanks for watching. Share, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.